bushland. There's a discovery mission underway for exoplanets. Some of them are in the centre of our galaxy, which is about 25,000 light years away. Exoplanets are planets outside our solar system. They're difficult to find because they don't emit their own light. But PhD student Katie Van Doru is tracking them down using a technique called gravitational microlensing. It relies on a chance alignment between Earth, a star and its exoplanet, and light from a background star. So this is one of the planetary systems that I've confirmed. It's called MOA 2013 BLG 220. <laughs> and it is a super Jupiter, so three times the size of Jupiter. Once the exoplanet's mass and distance are worked out, the information goes into an online archive, which can be accessed by scientists all over the world. Although many thousands of exoplanets have been discovered, uh, many of them are not all that interesting. Uh, and the ones we're discovering are kind of off the beaten path. We're using a relatively uh, specialized technique, and we find much more interesting planets than other people do. One thing working in Katie's favour is that Tasmania is one of the best places to observe our galaxy. Its unique position means that during winter nights, the Milky Way is directly overhead. Later this year, Katie is heading to NASA to further her work on exoplanets. The US has a lot of research around exoplanets, so it means I get a lot of exposure to a lot of other scientists, um, which will be cool. The next big step for exoplanets, finding out whether they can support life. Alexandra Alvaro, ABC News.